Okay, enough beating around the bush. It's about time I share my most prized, coveted, secret sound design technique for making shimmery, warbly, flanged out nonsense. And that is, of course, stacking literally 10 flangers on top of each other. Uh, so for this demonstration, it all starts with some sort of input. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to be using these paper tears. Uh, that doesn't sound warbly or shimmery at all. Well, don't you worry, as I'm sure that's what you're thinking. Uh, we're going to fix that right up real quick by doing a bunch of these. So I'm going to fast forward through this part, but essentially all I'm doing is just setting like the delay time from uh, 5 to around 30 milliseconds for each one. Depth a little bit down, rate a little bit down, and mix around like 50, feedback around like 52 as well. Wow, look at them sitting there looking all pretty. Uh, let's hear what that sounds like. Much better. Doesn't resemble paper tearing at all. And that's the goal. Instead, it's just flanged out, shimmery garbage. Perfect. Exactly what we wanted. Uh, that's the whole trick, basically. Uh, what I'll usually do from here is maybe like put filter freak after it um, with like a little bit of slow modulation just to get that like talking filter sweepy thing going on. Um, I'll just put in Pro L here as well just to make sure that we don't go over. Let's hear what that sounds like. Pretty cool. Maybe a little bit more gain. Uh, and just to convince ourselves that this is the coolest thing ever, we're going to put a little bit of reverb on it too, just because that makes everything sound better. Wow. You know what? I might even do a little bit of pitch shifting too, because it is a little bit high and harsh. Um, so I'll put that right before there, drop it a little bit, and then also do a little bit of soothe to help out with those really high-end frequencies just a bit. A little bit of that. Let's hear it. Sick. That's all she wrote. Um, I'll usually uh, do this with different plugins as well, because obviously you can do it with this free Fall Hollow Space Modulator, but you can do it with any flanger or delay as long as the manual offset of the delay time goes anywhere between 5 milliseconds to 30 milliseconds and has a little bit of built-in modulation too. Um, you can even like switch around the modes if you really want to get fancy or whatever. Uh, but that's it. Thanks.